Alright, come on. We're gonna catch some fish today. Here we go. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, just can't catch a fish if you if you try. Hey everybody, the balloon guy here with his balloon fishing pole. Look at that. With no fish. Um, I have a request today to do a fish. Now, earlier you saw my polka dotted fish, and I have a request to do a small itty bitty fish using um, a five inch print round balloon. So I have this beautiful blue with a tall print on it. So we're gonna make kind of a really fancy fish, and we're gonna use a smaller 160 green lime green here for the outside um, and then of course we'll have eyeballs and whatnot for that so we're going to make this little fish and we'll be able to attach it to the fishing pole so come along with me all right here we go all right so first thing we're going to do is i have my round here right we're going to build off of this and then we have this and uh I might pretty much do it like I would do the same thing with the large polka dot fish. It's just going to be really small. We're going to make some back fins we start around with and we'll do a circle around the balloon. Um, we get come up here, we take the nozzle end and we put that around there. So it, it wraps around and then we lock it through here and uh, that locks that in really nice. Then we're going to come around here. We're going to try to figure out our halfway point for for the fish lips. Uh, but first, we want to get as much out of this as we can. So we're just going to stretch this out. Remember, this is a 160 balloon. Now, just like the 260, the measurements have a meaning. Fully blown up, this is going to be about one inch di diameter, and the length is going to be about 60 inches. So we're going to come up to this, and uh, we are going to... Make ourselves a one bubble, like a little green grape there. We give that some really good twist, and then we're going to do one more bubble. We got two grapes there. That's going to end up being fish once we're done making them into pinch twist. We're going to take and just do one twist around, and then we're going to wrap this in between. At the same time, we're twisting this around so that we don't have any pops at all. So now, when this wraps around, we're gonna come across here. All right, now this five inch does not have anything to attach here. So we're gonna end up using glue dashes and when we're done here, but um, uh, on our other balloons, we actually have an attachment. Those are special linking balloons. Um, there's other way of doing sidewall bubbles and things. We're not going to do that today. Um, we're just going to use the dashes for simplicity. But we're going to wrap around this balloon. And we're going to find our spot here. And we're going to pinch this and then twist it so that we get a nice twist. And if you look here, we almost don't even need the um, we almost don't even need the dashes, the glue dashes. With the pressure here, it's, it's gonna um, fit it just nicely. Now here, we're gonna make one little dot here, and we're gonna so I can match the size of this balloon so that both fins are the same. And uh, that's it, we don't really need that bubble. So I am going to take and break it off. I don't want to lose any air out of the fins, that last fin, so I am tying the knot I'm just going to wrap it around a little bit more. So here we have a blue-green. Look at that little fishy. He's kind of cute. He's got sideways fishy lips. Let's fix that. 
<laughs> There's only one thing missing, and that is some eyes. And I have a <clears throat> five inch round here. It's just a white. <coughs> Excuse me. And we're gonna blow this up just a tiny bit because it's smaller balloon. We need smaller eyes. So we got that, and we're gonna take, give it a squeeze right in the middle so we can have the same size or as close as we can get eyeballs. Sometimes if they're different sizes, they look really creepy and cool at the same time. Kids love them, they're not bothered by it. Because it's just, a, a, the design is just really, it's just a cute balloon. And here we go. Yeah, if I was giving this away, I definitely would put, um, put on, I would definitely put on the glue dashes. I'm not going to worry about that for the video right now because it's not going to get played with like it would if a kid had it. So look at that cute little balloon. And then we're gonna give some pupils on those eyeballs. <laughs> look at that. Is that not cute? Blip, 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 blip. Hello, Mr. Balloon Guy. How are you? Oh, I'm doing good. And how are you doing today? So pretty cool, huh? Look at that. That's, she's all pretty with all the tattoo work, I guess you could call it. I don't know. Now, when I am at a gig, <coughs> I will make the, uh, the, uh, um, this thing here that catches fish, the fishing pole. And I will hand it to the kids or the adults, but mostly the kids. And I have them, this whole time I'm making a fish for them, I'm having them pretend that they're fishing and I go back to them I'm like are you did you catch anything yet got any boots any old cars or watches or anything and and throughout the whole thing it's no 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 so then when I get done with it I'm I I come up to their fishing line and I start pulling I said uh oh you got a tug there I wonder what you're gonna get I wonder what you're gonna get and at the same time I put the line through the fish's mouth Just like that. It's arguing with me, but I will win. So that it'll come out like that. And then I'm like, pull it up, pull it up, pull it up. You got a fish, you got a fish, you got a fish. And oh, there they go. They have a bluegill or something like that, whatever it is. And um, so, yeah, that's the fun. The fun part and uh, just exciting. Kids love it. It's, it's something they can play with. And uh, so, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this with uh, putting together a five inch round fish. And um, I'm the balloon guy. Um, and I just, for everybody who has liked a video, has, uh, has unliked a video, has uh, subscribed, I just want to thank you so much. I sure appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. All right. And from my family to yours, I hope that you have an amazing day. All right. I will see you next time. Time to catch and release the fish. Go on, little fishy. Oh, yeah. <laughs>